I'm tired of the show surrounding who's going to send tanks and when they're going to send them. Legitical response. What's up, everybody? Thanks for stopping by. This is Logitical Response. It's a show I put together to highlight politicians, what they're doing for us, what they're not doing for us, the good, the bad, the ugly, the corruption, everything going on inside the government that you might want to know about next time it comes time to vote. Now, as you may know, in the past midterm elections, we had a whole lot of politicians campaigning on spending because spending's out of control we kind of bad on the economy we kind of going into a recession and we need to curb some of the spending that's going on right now so they ran on that and a lot of republicans won because of that now what they're doing now that they in session they in the house what are they doing they're sending more money to ukraine why do they keep sending them all this money they just sent 45 billion dollars now they want to send more and they need to educate us on the stakes. Watch this. A lot of members of your conference, fellow Republicans, they want to stop giving money to Ukraine. Should Ukraine be worried that the money is going to stop coming from the U.S.? No, no. I think there's enough support on both sides of the aisle, majority in the the Democratic Party, majority in the Republican, the national security chairman like myself support this. We, We have to educate our members. I don't think they quite understand what is at stake. She brings up a really, really good question right there, and he acts like we just have unlimited funds. We don't have unlimited funds, dude. That's the kind of reckless spending that got us into the deficit we're at right now. I can't believe this guy's just, hey, here's a blank check. There you go. We can't do that, man. We really need to think about getting this guy out of office. Now, this next little bit coming up is Lindsey Graham. He's a senator from South Carolina, I believe, or North Carolina. I'm not sure right off the top of my head, but this is pure political theater right here coming up. He's flanked by two far-left Democratic senators acting like this is some kind of bipartisan, unhinged rant about sending tanks to Ukraine. M1 Abrams tanks, our tanks. We should be sending diplomats, not tanks. Watch this. All three of us, Republicans and Democrats, share the same goal. For Ukraine to drive the Russians out of Ukraine. To achieve that goal, the Ukraine military needs tanks. I'm tired of the show surrounding who's going to send tanks and when they're going to send them. It's funny, he wants to talk about a shit show. Well, I personally believe that was a shit show, and he really needs to get his priorities straight. I mean, seriously, the longer this war goes on, the more and more people die. Screw spending money. We really need to stop the fighting. That's what needs to happen. We need to stop supporting these people and get them to stop fighting. Period. That's it. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like that's going to happen. And that's all I got for this one, y'all. Look, thanks for watching, and we're going to keep our eye on these people just to see exactly what they're doing. So the next time election time comes around, we're going to know exactly who to vote for. Now, thank y'all for watching, and be positive. Peace.